Welcome everybody. I'm here at the Japanese self-defense ground self-defense forces public information center. The 10 a.m. at night, where you're coming from. It's 11 here. And it's ex extremely hot, so I hope my uh, phone doesn't overheat or my gimbal. I think this is one of the most interesting Japanese tanks to me. I'm probably going to sneak inside a few times because it's so incredibly hot. I'm literally melting. How's the quality, you guys? Thank you, Tim. That's good to hear. Where are you guys from? Look at this gigantic thing. It's a Type 94 Beach Mine Layer Vehicle. Is this a Type 78? Anti air. Sydney, Australia. If you look at the size comparison with the anti air and the mine layer vehicle. Like maybe you should go to sleep, yes. <laughs> if it's 6 a.m. I'm so in doubt in what I want to make a walk around of its vehicle for YouTube because one thing my camera is overheating because of the heat. I'm also overheating because of the heat. So I need to pick my battles here. I'm probably going to do this thing because that just interests me. And maybe this one but there's a chain link fence around it, so maybe not. And maybe the uh, the anti-air. I'm going to do a live stream of. And I'm not going to film behind me because I don't want to get into trouble. Because that's a military base behind me. Does the World of Tanks of War Thunder even have this type of tank? I know that it has the one next to it. But for you guys playing that uh, game... Is this one in the game? It's a Type 10. There's not really a list of all the tank museums. I only think there's hmm, three museums that has tanks in Japan. And one is only one tank and the other one has only two tanks. This one also has some World War II Japanese tanks, but I think in storage and publicly shown only for events.
like some Japanese made Humvee. Just a copy of course. And some rocket uh, systems on top. It's extremely warm here. I'm literally burning up. I had it warmer once in France, but this, if you are walking for more than one hour in the blazing sun, you're pretty much done. It's, uh, it's uh, 35 degrees Celsius and that, I think that's uh, 80. Fahrenheit isn't it? Or 70 Fahrenheit? <laughs> Your mom is going to kill you because you are watching this and you are going to wake her up. <laughs> but it's tanks, but this is a helicopter, if she busts you now you are pretty much done for. Sorry? Yes. Oh. Hello. <laughs> hey, hello. hello. Nice to meet you. Yeah. Yeah, nice to meet you too. <laughs> hello. <laughs> Konnichiwa. Is it okay to take a picture with you? Yes, yes. Oh. Uh, is it okay if I film? Uh, oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> Do you live in Japan? No, uh, no, 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 no. I'm uh, from uh, Oranda, Oh, really? Yeah, oh, yeah, so yeah, you're yeah. lucky. Yeah. You're so lucky. Uh, he used his YouTube channel. He records tanks and, does, and has a lot of information about it. Wow. You're really lucky that you are on this day, a particular day. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> and then you run into fans out here. That's so funny. I don't know if there are tank machines in Turkey. Are there? They probably are in Turkey. Are you from Turkey? I thought it was a uh, Japanese made Yui, but it's just Yui. It's a Yui uh, 1H. Transmission oil access. So I'm probably going to move inside now because I'm burning up. Let me know if you want to see something special with these things. And I'm going to have a look at it. Sorry, I missed your chat. I have no idea how, you, how do you become a World War II vehicle nerd. You're just, yeah, you're just born as a World War II vehicle nerd. Okay, let's go inside. There's airco. It's, it's a Japanese Cobra, I think, helicopter. And I 
think Swan is also uh, in World of Tanks. But that's Reddit. It's always uh, yeah, a shitstorm sometimes. Yeah, it's the Type 90 yet. Yeah. I know that uh, Tamiya has this model. Sorry for the sound glare. Light says it was a normal hatcher photo, and I don't know all those vehicles, and it feels so bad. <laughs> That's Reddit for you. The volume is low. Maybe it's because I'm inside now. I don't know if the quality is changed. I'm sort of glad that the volume is low because of copyright music. But is the quality low, guys? Okay, it's okay. Um, even though I let says even though the quality is low, I'm just going to watch it anyway. <laughs> yeah, the sun glare is uh, terrible. Uh, I'm not a fan of the sun uh, at this particular moment. The light level is going up and down, yeah, indeed. Yeah, yeah, come on. Come on. Yeah, this is uh, in Japan, a marksman. It's the uh, public information center of the Japanese uh, ground self-defense force. <laughs> you were here. Yeah, I just saw you, right? You would figure that everything was uh, to know. Yeah, that's probably because there's some automotive <laughs> reasons. And production reasons also. 
lady. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> I think we have all seen it now. Konnichiwa. That's it. Sorry? Uh, no. <laughs> so I'm, fa I'm from uh, Oranda. <laughs> yeah, going back into the heat and, and die a little. But yeah, if you want to know some of these things, I'm going to have a look at one. But if not, I'm going to start filming some walk around. And I'm going to quit this live stream. See, there's also a path you can go down there, another museum building. I'm not sure though, but if I find something, I'm going to live stream it again. And I think that my phone is doing okay because I've seen a lot of guys streaming in extreme heat. And. I'm not going to climb off top of them. <laughs> it's probably not going to make me popular here. I'm going to visit the uh, Tamiya Museum and headquarters. This is also something interesting here. It's probably for some uh, external, external gun uh, points. Google blenders, ball mounts, you can close them up. And that one is right and drive. Yeah, indeed. And this one is, uh, is the other way around again. It's really interesting. Yeah, it's closed off gun ports and can close them up from the inside. Armored personnel carrier. Here's three positions. Anime is fun. Indeed. Japanese is right hand drive. Man. Oh, look. Look, see what this is left hand drive, the right hand drive. It's also an interesting uh, sort of uh, driver position. A piece of glass on top. What do I need to wait for, dirt tank? The STV one, you mean this? This one? I think this one is a the Type 98 armored combat vehicle. Everything is uh, Japanese here, of course. What does he want from the Hamas subscribers? That the exhaust ports are not kept for storage. <laughs> what do you mean about that? I think they're. I think these things are pretty much good, taken care of by the looks of it. But the sun does a lot of damage and can see that clearly. Yeah. Light says, why I don't understand anything here. <laughs> Type 47. This is the Type 47 indeed. 
but it's uh, almost 20 uh, it's already 20 minutes now so I'm going to quit this live stream and I'm going to film some of it some of these things do some walkarounds and then I'm the then I'm done maybe I'm doing some live stream over there because there's another museum museum building over there and maybe I'm going to some live streams uh, about scale modeling uh, later this day your desk is being invaded by ants send help this says have fun thank you and funky uh, cat says type 74 is very similar to the stp one it's probably just a copy or a uh, japanese made uh, stb one well, I'll see you in the next live stream, guys. Enjoy the last uh, few minutes of these things.